A breaking news update tonight as we continue to cover the huge house fire in Wilmer that broke out sending three people to the hospital. News 5 was the only station there to bring you live coverage of the fire and the victim's arrival to the hospital during our 6 o'clock and 6.30 newscast this evening. Also, 56,000 of you watched the story unfold on Facebook Live on WKRG's Facebook fan page. Our coverage continues tonight live with News 5's Alan Carter, who's been reporting from the scene of the fire on Cuss Fork Road all evening and into the night. Alan joins us now live. Alan, what more can you tell us about the fire? Well, just a few short moments ago, crews left the scene here, and you can see the home behind me. It is a little bit dark now, but... Uh, a total loss at this point from a fire that injured three people, one of which, as you mentioned, did have to be life flighted. Fire officials say all indications at this point say that this started with a propane explosion related to a gas grill. Crews were on the scene fighting the fire for hours. They say the home a total loss. The man lighting the grill was life flighted. His wife and daughter were taken by ambulance. Neighbors described them as a friendly couple, all of them shaken up by what happened here. Um, you know, we just we just need everyone's prayers that that they're going to be okay. Um, I do know that that the gentleman is probably a little worse than the, the wife, and so we just we need to come together and support this family and try to get anything that they need. And the extent of the family's injuries are not all exactly known at this time. We're told a dog did die in this fire. Three firefighters were also treated for heat exhaustion, but they are expected to be okay. Reporting live in Wilmer, Alan Carter, News 5.